y'all what's up it's your girl miss tnt the fit gardener we are out here in the fit garden oh look at my baby that's my baby my newest baby right there y'all can see her siblings even though they're not family but they are family the dragon fruit babies are right up there in those purple pots but that's not our focus today today I was in my little fruit basket where all the fruits are and some sweet potatoes were buried in there. And look at all of this, you guys. I didn't even know this was happening because this end of it was sticking out. And so I just thought like, hey, sweet potatoes over there chilling. I'm at the moment not in the mood for sweet potatoes. So I won't worry. I already have one that's inside of some water with some, uh, Fix, try getting some roots so I wasn't even tripping off of this over here and I just looked in and I saw that this poor one is on his deathbed but I'm going to rescue these little sh slips before I compost him so Lead Farmer 73 you're awesome I was wondering about this and I wasn't sure but I'm glad that Lady Lead told you to do this and look at this hello hi 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 look at him say hi guys thanks lucky for your uh cameo appearance so what i'm gonna do which i i was pretty sure that i could do Pop these little babies off. I got this little. Hi. <laughs> this little cup, I cut it and I'm going to put water in here. Put these little slips in. As soon as, excuse me, as soon as I get some roots, they're going in the dirt. So, I wanted to take you guys along with me and we'll track the progress of this until, until we get some. Potatoes. So let's do it. All right, you guys. So that was super easy. We, I, I have way more than I expect to have. So this little, this little cup is not gonna be big enough. But I'm gonna put it in some water. Show you guys in a second and put it in the house. Put these slips in here and now they have these roots all right y'all so we are at the next step of this process you see these roots they have literally grown so much that they are climbing out of the water and so now it's time to plant them and let them get to work so here are the tubs we're going to use to plant them in and I'm going to give each of these their own box so that they have enough space to do their thing. Alright, so this is what I'm going to do. After I finish poking the holes, I'm going to fill up these containers in a uh, layered lasagna type of style so it'll be leaves dirt leaves dirt so that the soil is loose and drainy and the potatoes have room to do their thing so let's get to it y'all all right y'all so that's the process filled up now i'm going to put the babies in and I'm gonna water first and then put the babies in and then do a little sprinkle water after that. All right, so I'm gonna slow it down one time and let you see what's happening. So here is the slip with some roots. I'm just poking some holes and sticking it inside, bringing the soil around it. And you guys, this is my first time doing it this way. So 
we're gonna see together how it turns out. Last time I planted sweet potato, potatoes directly into the ground, but when I went to harvest them, I was like digging everywhere, like, oh, I wonder if there's some here, I wonder if there's some here. This way, I will have an idea of exactly where they can be, and yeah. Look at this baby right here. She ready? All right, y'all. So, let's show you what's going on. The babies are in. It is windy out here. All right, got those babies in there. This, this one has the most, they were kind of small. I hope they still get big and do their thing. I have a few more slips inside that I might divide between these two since they have the least amount. But yeah, that's it you guys. So I will check back in in a minute. Today is, let's see what today is May 18th so we will see you guys in about a week and see how they're doing here are the sweet potato tubs and they're getting some growth they're looking much greener leaves are getting bigger so we'll come back in a little while for a part two of this and see how they're doing. Thanks you guys for watching and hanging out. Peace.